On the 10th we hit it a pace, so we trained to chest today, did some, you know, incline bench press, some flies, um, incline dumbbell presses, and closed grip bench press as well, um, and then just a seated bench press to vary it off. So I did a complete chest day today, I only really filmed the bench because it was the only thing I felt up filming. Uh, and then we went out and we ran some hills and we did some hill sprints capping it off with 11 only because I miscounted so 11 hill sprints of 50 meters uh, up a bit of an incline uh, conventional going at 100% effort so going as flat out as I possibly can and then I finished off with 5 sets of that 50 meters again but running up it backwards as fast as I could just for uh, some knee and joint health slash mobility it's always a super big burner on my calves my quads and my hamstrings as well when I when I do that that backwards running up a hill and then obviously walking down the hill backwards as my recovery in between sets so it's like you run your 40 meters or 50 meters then you get about 40 or 50 seconds to walk down the hill backwards stretch out your calves uh, and then you come around you turn around and you do it again Feeling quick, um, I think feeling quicker than last week, and last week it buggered my calves up quite a lot uh, to do all this, all that hill sprints for the first time in, in years. But uh, feeling really good, I felt like it added to an aspect of my running uh, in that the other night I was able to hit 20, a sub 20 minute 5k for the first time ever. And I credit a little bit of that to my hill sprints and uh, the energy that the hill sprints gave me. So something I will continue to do. Um, but a solid workout, getting a bit of sunshine and just, yeah, completely exhausting myself. So cheers, thank you very much and have a good one.